always cool to see those memorabilia things pop up. Um, every time I see that, I always get eager to, I've got like 6,000 football cards myself and three different binders over the day. I know I have Marshawn Lynch's rookie card from when he was on the bills in like a plastic case and it's like uh, graded and stuff. So hang on to that. Obviously he had kind of, well, I, I wouldn't say a short career, but being a running back, they don't have the careers that kickers, punters and quarterbacks do, but um, yeah, it's kind of, it'd be interesting to go through that and kind of see what kind of cards I have. And just, I don't think I have a, a Tom Brady rookie card. I do have a Brett Favre and an Aaron Rodgers one. So those will kind of be ones that gain value over the years. But um, yeah, always cool to see this kind of stuff come up now and then and makes you wonder, it's like, who the heck's got two, two and a quarter million burning a hole in their pocket that they're like, I got to have this one card. And that, and he's still oh. playing. That's what's crazy. It's gonna go Not up after he retires. Tom Brady fan. What's well, that? that's probably why. He, that's probably why he bought it now is to resell it when he retires. Make oh yeah, profit. you could probably sell it for double as soon as he retires. <laughs> exactly. Like how you mentioned, you have a couple cards. I got a handful of things that are some pretty pennies for sports memorabilia. Obviously, the longer you hold on to it, the more it's just gonna be worth. So. There's really no need to get rid of him. Like, I got a Mario Lemieux bobblehead signed from his rookie season with the Pittsburgh Penguins. I have a Wayne Gretzky bobblehead also signed. Um, got a Brett Favre rookie card signed for the Falcons. Um, I have a football signed by the 1996 Green Bay Packers uh, Super Bowl team. So that's really cool. Um, yeah, it's definitely cool to s- shit that you get when you're a kid you don't think anything of it and then 20 years later it's worth 2.25 million dollars and you're just like hell yeah dude